All right, well, it's been a little while since I've unboxed a two and a half inch SSD, but the reality of it is there hasn't really been anything new to talk about. So today I have something that is new to talk about. This is a new capacity of Vertex 2 from OCZ. Okay, that's not what's new about it. It features the Sandforce controller with reads up to 285 megs per second and writes up to 275 megs per second. That's also not new. And it features 25 nanometer flash. That's new. So 25 nanometer flash is the reason why this capacity is different from the other ones. 25 nanometer means higher densities, and it also means more potential for errors. So OCZ had to really tweak and rework the firmware. This is a natural progression as the, as the flash gets to be higher and higher density there becomes more potential for there to be mistakes when you're writing to it. So they had to work in uh, extra capacity that's built in for error correction, as well as make some tweaks to the firmware in order to make the Sandforce controller work with the 25 nanometer flash. So that was pretty much it. Um, if all you wanted to know is what is the difference between the new Vertex 2 SSDs and the old ones. So the new ones are in capacities like, say for example, 80 gig and 160 gig. And the old ones are in capacities like 60, 120, and 240. So if you wanted to know what the difference is, the difference is 25 nanometer versus 34 nanometer flash. And uh, obviously a, a different firmware because they are using different flash. But the performance is pretty much the same. The reliability is pretty much the same because of the hard work that uh, Sandforce and OCZ do on their products to make sure that they don't die. Speaking of not dying, uh, let me just double check here, but I'll let you guys know what the warranty is for this particular drive. Last time I checked, I think it was two years. We're gonna have to check that. I think there's a card inside that tells us actually, oh, here's something new on their packaging, Mac. Check that out. So this SSD is completely Windows and or Mac compatible. Oh yeah, if you want to see the general specs, here it is. Zoomed in, you can pause that and read that if you want to. So that's the full specs. Other than that, they haven't changed the packaging much. It still includes a two and a half inch to three and a half inch drive adapter. Uh, I don't see any screws, so uh, I hope you have some screws included with your case. You probably do. Okay, so that just goes in there. Slips into the back of the foam packaging. And on the other side, we find a couple things. First, my SSD is faster than your HDD, that is hard disk drive or solid state drive. And yes, yes it is. It's faster than any hard disk drive out there. All right, here we are, warranty stuff. Okay, epitomize a new vanguard of quality products. Warranted, tested, should conform to, okay. Duration of three years. Okay, there we go, three years on the Vertex 2. Oh, there's the screws. Okay, so that's all the screws you'll need for mounting the drive with the adapter. So if you don't have a case like the Fractal Design Define uh, R3 or any other case that has two and a half inch drive mounts, then you will need to use that adapter and you can use that to mount it anywhere a three and a half inch drive would go. So we'll have a look at the SSD itself, which looks pretty much the same as any other Vertex 2 SSD from OCZ. You got your standard SATA 2. Remember, this is still SATA 2 interface. There's your data, there's your power. Here's some, uh, oh, it looks like there were some jumper pins there, but they are not part of the uh, final design. And then here we've got the, yeah, okay, rated for DC 5 volts. Some do not drop, do not press. Be careful with it, basically. Warranty boy to remove, so don't try and remove the, uh, Covering from it, you got your standard mounting holes on the side and the bottom, so this is going to be compatible with pretty much any laptop out there as well. I actually actually recently installed an SSD in a laptop for my aunt, which I unboxed. It was a Sony Vio a little while back. So thank you for checking out my unboxing of the new, all new and improved OCZ Vertex 2 25 nanometer. So that is 80 gig and 160 gig right now, and who knows what else is coming because. One of the big improvements with higher density flash is that we're going to see bigger capacities and lower prices over the next uh, coming months. Don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other tech videos.